and welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Blaze Black 2. And in today's episode, we're going to be, I guess we're just going to continue what we're doing. But we didn't do any training in between episodes, so the way my team ended off last episode is the same as this one. I mean, Cutler does have a good point. There's no way to stick your neck inside this. Yeah, okay, so... I didn't really get to use burner that much. <laughs> Okay, so Flygon, you're a monster in the- you were the monster in the last gym, but let's- let's test out your newfound earthquake powers. I have so many windows up. I need to delete some of this damn thing. Oh yeah, I'm, I'm, I've been playing, oh yeah guys, it's pretty interesting, might as well show you guys this. I've been playing a, a lot of Mega Man 8-bit Death Knight recently, you might be seeing that on my channel in the near future. I have no idea what you guys are seeing. I guess I was just caught. Well, that was, oh, it's causing all the lag right now. But since my computer can't run this game that good, I'm still just expect to see some lag spikes occasionally. Whatever. We don't want to. I don't want to use Charizard and demolish a Snover with Flamethrower. Gotta work and handle this pretty. Oh, I thought it was Snover. It's Snow Rent apparently. Well, it still does count. Metang and Sneasel. 
Charizard is the perfect Pokemon for this. Yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about. Before it was level 25, and now it's level 30, um, it's either 38 or 39. Um, but either way, I think you still get the point. Actually, you should have attacked the Metang, because I'm pretty sure the Stalin will target the... Actually, maybe it did target the Metang. Muck. Oh my god, if we're gonna come in against this muck. Can't muck learn some sort of ghost? Yeah, I can learn Shadow Sneak, that's it. Actually, that's a pretty good combo. Um, It's, we're not in Gen 6, so Bullet Punch isn't going to do that much damage. You don't know what I mean. In later generations, um, Gardevoir is a um, fairy type, so um, Bullet Punch would be super effective in that case. I have nothing against this. I'm gonna have to calm mind, calm mind to be able to hit, hit this thing with anything. Attack the stealth like oh god, it went for me again. Damn it, you got paralyzed. Stop wild charging. Do you have anything good? Citrus berry. Do you have anything that's better against this thing? I'm I'm stuck having to spam calm mine against this thing. Oh god, I'm, oh god, I'm about to die. Do I have any full heals? Uh I have paralyzed heals. Please attack the Stellan, don't attack me. And of course it does attack it decides to attack me anyway. Well Lori Sharon, I'll be nice. I won't earthquake the I won't earthquake I'll, um uh, yeah, I have no choice. I always fought on Blaze Black. It was a missed opportunity for Drail not to give Magnezone and Magneton and Magnemite, obviously, because they're all floating. Levitate. I I really like Drayana's raw max. Don't get me wrong. I think I think they're challenging and interesting and stuff like that. But I but I did think that was a missed opportunity. Uh, what would you think of combo to go along superior? Um. Um, I want to bring in something that can just can take on. Um, uh, oh my Gardevoir is dead, so I can't bring him. In. All right, starter alongside starter. God, Hugh, I didn't know that your superior was that strong. Oh God. Okay, we got poisoned on this thing. Can you get any more unlucky? Never mind. Okay, I have Mega Horn, so I can hit that Victory Bell. Okay, Hugh, I need you to go for something good against the Garbodor. Oh, come on, Slam! <sighs> never. And of course, this. And of course, it doesn't kill. If I only still had Flame Burst on Charged, I could bring that out in Flame Burst. Oh, actually, maybe the Growlithe does. Okay, that. that uh, can you please tell me you have Flame Burst on that thing? Or just attack the Victory Bell um, with anything. I don't really care. Because I, this Gardevoir won't die no matter what we do. God, please stop sludge bombing. Oh, come on, dig! And Leaf Tornado. Hey, I didn't know. I guess Drayana gave it that because I don't think Victory Bell regularly can learn that. 
Okay, good. Okay, you have the sucker punch. No, not sucker punch. I meant sacred sword. I got mixed up. Got a wheezing. It's a viper. Wheezing is levitate. Oh, God. Please attack the wheezing. No, oh, well, you're obviously not gonna. Self destruct! Oh, God. Alright, I'm gonna bring in Flygon and start earthquaking things. Alright, since all right, since Growlithe is underground, this earthquake won't hit it. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I didn't know that earthquake functioned like that. Oh god, that's not good. Oh, I'm so sorry, Hugh. I didn't I I didn't I I I didn't know that Earthquake had hit did did do did that. Can you don't have any items on me? Hey, we have a Vibrava again alongside Flygon. Luckily, you have Levitate, so it will be a greater time to start earthquaking things. This is a really good combo. If I ever find myself in a double battle, I should bring Flygon alongside Charizard so I can so I can use Earthquake with Flygon and be immune to it with Charizard. Yeah, you guys are terrible. I uh, do. I think we do. We have to battle this guy. I can't remember. Oh, I have my own legendary dragon type Pokemon. I have um Flygon, sort of. Yeah, the ship's gone now, Hugh. Well, what a big surprise. Whatever. I guess we're gonna spend the rest of the episode just which just go try just trying to survive through Charged Stone Cave. I always hated Charged Stone Cave. Okay, just, I'm sure I have the, let's get some repels. I'm just gonna waste my, I'm just gonna waste all of my money on repel. And a super repel too. We're gonna be battling plenty of trainers inside of this thing. We'll be taking. I'm, I, I, we're going to be taking all the Hoenn gym leaders in the rematch form, not the regular forms. All right. So where the heck is those super potions? They're not super potions. I meant super repels. Let's see. I'm going to use this last. This only super repel to get through this part. But I already battled this trim. If I was wrong. A deerling. Perfect. Do we have to switch somebody to different to the front? Chancy. Okay, okay. Let's go to Razor and have it, and have it die in one hit from Sacred Sword. All right, Chancy, eat up the Sacred Sword and don't eat it up because your defenses are absolute garbage and you're a normal type. I've actually seen somebody use Flare Blitz on a Blissey and then they got killed from their own recoil because Blissey has so much HP. <laughs> I laughed when I first saw that. I was like, what? <laughs> uh, seriously, that was the best. Uh, uh. God, I really hate. 
I think it's actually a good idea when slow Pokemon use curse because they're gonna be because they're gonna be slower no matter what, so it doesn't matter. I mean my samurai was always faster. But either way, it doesn't matter really boosting his defense, I still managed to KO it. I guess I already bowed the tree. Now we got the Surf HM. This is exactly what I was looking for. I'm tired of having to spam Razor Shell and then Aqua Tail for a little bit while with my Samoid. But I finally don't need to do that. Take the Surf, finally. God, it's, it's barely, though. It's barely in the right place. Surf is supposed to be above strength and not under it. I wish that once you said it, it would automatically make all TMs like that. Eh, more trainers, whatever. Parasect? I really should switch out something different for my lead. Why Why are you X specially against something that's gonna KO you in one hit? Parasect's okayly fast. Maybe you can outspeed my charger and spore me, because I believe it's a high enough level to be able to learn spore. Okay, it's time to test out my newly learned Surf abilities. Okay. Right, we have someone knocking at the door. I forgot about the... F I forgot about that. She could have just returned. Hey, Ellie, your mom's here. God. Do I have anything that can hit this thing? Uh, I have, I have, I, I do have excess around my Skeptile, so I can go ahead and use that. Hip low. <gasps> Why did you forewarn my ex, my Dragon Pulse? I'm gonna excess are you, obviously. I feel like that's a pretty useless ability because it just pulls for a random move, even if it's not the move that you're gonna use. <laughs> A moonstone? That's a pretty good item. What's a, what's a pretty... Eh, if it depends if it's a good item or not. Oh. Fungus. Oh god, I should I should really switch out switch charge for something else. Oh god, can they get that? Well do they ever shut up? Give me that Ultra Ball. Even though I don't need it because I've already caught my full. Damn it! Hey, it's a Kabaleon. I wish if you could catch Kabaleon this early on. That would be awesome. But. Anyway, so. Okay, so we need to. Others repeat. If I remember correct, if my member serves me correctly, there we go. Yeah, it does this piece does heal you? Yeah, sport. I already switched it out. All right, perfect timing. I can use max repels with the rest of. I always really, I always really hated, I, I always really hated Charmstone Cave, but what are you gonna do when, damn it. Come on, Bianca, just don't interrupt me. I know how those floating stones work. Alright, okay, just, just be careful. Damn it! Okay, I'm, oh, it's a ghost gem. Actually, it's not that bad. I'm, do, none of my Pokemon have a ghost type. Moonstone, another one. 
full heal. I picked up a lot of items. I picked up a lot of items in that last few stretch. Um, wrong side. I always hated the spinner. You can just be sneaking up and they all of a sudden just like, boom! Oh, there's a spin right in front of you. And also a pain to avoid if you just want to. Or this coughing has a levitate, so I can't hit it with, um... Um, with Earthquake. But luckily I can hit it with Strength. Gyro Ball. Is, I, 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 I never knew, is it Gyro Ball or Gyro Ball? Um, I don't know, I may never know. <laughs> oh god, that was, that was terrible! I clicked Fly by accident and ended up paying off. Hi? You doing a recording? Yeah, I yeah. am. Signal Beam? Oh god, I got, I got hit by Aftermath. I really hate Aftermath. Alright, eat up this Earthquake Nido King. I mean, Cake Queen. Focus band, uh, that might come in helpful it's handy at some point. I could have used that against the seismitoad because I would have been able to live up. You know, I managed to beat it anyway because my um my Samrock completely walled the set. I wouldn't say walled, it didn't like resist all of his moves, so walled is a bit of an overstatement. I would think that um did good against it is a better description because I can live the earthquake hydro pump ice punch and what's his other move I forgot? God, I love this mechanically. You can just use it on a repel. You, can, you can't just dodge this guy. I know this is a triple battle, or if he might be a rotation battle. I can't remember. Alright, okay, so I'm going to need to plan this out very carefully. Um... This will work pretty well. I can't remember what Pokemon he carries. I just know it's a triple or rotation battle. Galvantula, Sazbuck, and Vaporeon. Okay, that's pretty dangerous. Um, that's nice and jam dangerous. Um, that's really good. It's really bad. Um, luckily I carry Shockwave, so I can hit it with the. I can flame for the Sazbuck, and this is why I put Flygon over here so I can go for Earthquake. And oh god, this is the best thing I've ever done. Hey, Katie. Okay, and so the Sazbuck dies, and now I can Earthquake it because it won't hit, hit Gardevoir because it's obviously it's on the other side. I can be immune to it. I can shock. I can hit the Vapor and Shockwave. Um, which that uh, doesn't quite kill, but it does a lot of damage. Okay, I got I got earthquaked. <laughs> it just aqua rings. <laughs> it's pretty depressing. <laughs> it's pretty... Okay, I can just dragon pulse it to finish it off. I should have actually put charms on the side because with dragon pulse will be able to hit all the way from the other side. Um, in case it somehow misses, and I guess I can go for strength in case it somehow misses. Right there we go. God, get the shockwave on you. And the only damage I took was a signal beam. I'm not gonna have Gardevoir out anymore because if, if with the with its move set in this in the cave, I'm it's gonna be worthless to battle against anything. Oops, uh, that was my mistake. God, the movement's terrible.
Pharaoh for? Where did I? I switched up to Samurai, and the first enemy that comes up is a Pharaoh for. Well, luckily, at least Sacred Sword would still be super. Damn it! He lived! Ugh, lived on that little amount of health. Uh, should I go for Surf and risk the, 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 it for some reason not killing? Why didn't I go for Sacred Sword? I have more PP, so actually it does make more sense to go for Sacred Sword. Thanks for the chest of areas, but I don't really need them. Iron. I, I can't really, Katie. I'm in the middle of the, my recording. Well, I can't really stop at the middle. It's funny, the nugget, I think that's the joke. The nugget will gives you the big nugget, and the, the nugget bag gives you the, the small one. Oh, God. I don't even know what this area is. Katie, stop it! I'm doing. I'm. Tr God, oh God. Just go ahead and battle me. I have a. Sp I have spare time. Oh. Get. We eat up this mega horn. Oh God! The thing is, the thing barely did any damage. Um, okay, I can live this next leaf blade, I'll be able to take it. Or I can just get a max damage roll and be able to kill it. Oh yeah, waiting for me to make a move? Well, I'm gonna make this move against you, huh? What is that? I don't even know what that movie. I don't even know what Snatch even does. He's just there to just brag about how how nerdy you are for using that move. I don't know. Maybe it does do something that I don't know. More Chesto berries. <laughs> it's gonna really help me when I fall asleep. I think that's what Chesto berries do. Maybe I should go check that. Uh, yeah, it does.